Hey there YouTube, Rock and Rodimus, back here again. We're having a little massive deal for a change, something I've done in a while. Playing against a very good friend of mine, Roscoe, and we're having a Cyber Dragon mirror match. This will be very, very interesting. Ooh. He's gold five. Ah, oh, he's letting me go first, he's smart. He's very smart. Alright, let's do this. Oh, <laughs> he's got a giant R, that's class. Okay, okay. We have plays here, we have plays. So... <sighs> mm-hmm. Okay, first we do this. Let's see. I uh, don't want to activate Max C just yet, but I will do it in the next turn. I think we add this. Is that the play? Yeah, I think that's the play. Because then we special summon this. Discard this. Now the effect of the yes. Well, let me to add. Cyber Dragon hand, just in case things go south. Like a normal summon Cyber Dragon dry. Use this effect to make them level five. Which means right off the bat we can go into Cyber Dragon Infinity. I think this is the right play. With the mirror match, it's better if I get my infinity out first, means I can negate anything he wants to do. The question is, do I bring back the Nags? Do I bring back the max? I don't think there's any point in it. I mean, especially someone that becomes level 5. But... Oh well, I wanted to use this effect so that doesn't matter. So, I'm just going to go straight into infinity. And knowing he probably plays the same deck as me, I will not be putting this in the extra monster zone. Because of a little card called... Is it Chimeritic? I'm terrible with names. Uh, where is it? Chimeritic Megafleet Dragon. There we go. Oh, Imperm. I can negate the Empire. Uh, you know what? That's 2100. I'm going to send that to the Because the Empire is going to be an absolute bastard. I'm good. Let's see what happens. Okay. 
Okay, let's see what we got, Roscoe. Okay, very similar to my opening hand. Do I want to negate it? Because if I'm right, it is not once per turn. If I negate that... Hmm... Or do I max see it? I'm gonna max see. So make it me an Ash Blossom, make it me something else. Uh, I don't want to negate my max see, so that's fine. Oh, was that a Cyberdark? Cyberdark Chimera. Oh, Machine Dupe, that's good if I had. Oh, what's this do? I don't know if you deck the Gerard with a different name. Oh! That's pretty smart. Ah! Do I negate this? Right. Send one Cyberdark monster from your deck to the Gerard with a different name from the cards in your group. So you can't send another Chimera. Hmm. I'm gonna let this slide. What is he sending? That may have been a silly move. I mean, I should have just negated the start. I do have T Roar. Cyberdark Claw. I'm gonna cut to a monster. Right, okay, so it's not equipped right now. Is this... Ah, Power Bond. Okay, so he's, he's he's got stuff on the field, so he could go into Seeger. But I can negate its effect and destroy it, so that's not a problem. Hmm. Oh! Gaia! Oh, I'm a hundred short! I don't mind imagining a Cyber Dragon T's hand, that's fine. Plus, I don't want to win my life points anymore. Uh, yeah, okay, I should have stopped this whole combo. I think Ross wins this. I mean, I have outs, but I need to draw into them. Because, like, that dies. I special summon this, normal summon this. Alright, well played, Ross. Well played. I knew it. The funniest thing I said, they're not negated. Oh, that's good. Right. How do I do this? I know how to do this. It's very easy how to do this. I start by special summoning Cyber Dragon. Yeah, I just take his monster here. With Infinity. Normal summon this. I use the effect. Then I go into Nova, Infinity, take his monster. More negates. Oh, do I do this? Do I do this just to be cheeky? Take that. Leaves me a 21 and a 24. Hmm. No, no, I don't. I don't. I do this. Okay, I know what to do. I went in over and then I machine dupe the thing in the grave. And then I do some shenanigans. Right, so effect special summon. Yeah, this is the play, this is the play, this is the play, this is the play.
Yeah, this is the play. Yeah, I win this turn. Now I fit the effect. Oh, I'm at that cheeky. Yeah, I'm that cheeky. I feel horrible doing this. I'm sorry, Ross. It's going to get a lot worse this second, mate. It's a convoluted turn, but I've won. Unless he's got a hand trap in hand. It stops like a Karibo or something like that. Nope, oh, my leg just went there. So yeah, I summoned two Cyber Dragons to the field. <laughs> oh god, I mean, New, New Yu Gi Oh is busted, like terribly busted, but oh god, I love it. Because now I do one of two things I take his monster with this. Or I take it with that and that and fuse. Hmm. Either way, I go into my infinity that has materials. <laughs> I'll keep you there. Or they just put a material on my other infinity just in case. Hmm. You know what? Yeah, I need. Oh, you know what? I could be a right dick. <laughs> could be a right dick. Uh. No, I'll leave that just in case. I'm not going to be that guy. Uh, I'll just use the effect of this to take his monster. And I think I want to go into Seeger. That's two, four, six, eight, nine, two. But with Seeger, at least I don't have a 200 attack monster. You know what? I'm fine. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Unless... Yeah, I think that's good. I've got 9 2 on the board. I don't think he has any... Yeah, that's good. The long winded way of doing it, but it's game. Oh, I wish I had comms with Ross, man, but he's on a mobile. He's not on the PlayStation, so I can't get a room set up. And I don't have Discord set up with him yet. That's GG. There we go. Hundred to zero. <laughs> oh god, that was good. Well, well played to Ross, and I think if he's up for it, we'll have a game two. So I might see you all in game two.